Vask is here with the biggest and the most detailed train station that I ever created in City Skylines. So this is the train station for the passenger slash industry slash cargo. So it's very big, very detailed and I want to show you every single thing that I done here because it's a pretty big one. I need to zoom out to show you exactly how big is this build because I have two passenger stations and I have a big support for my industrial or the cargo section. You can see here that we have a two ports but let's begin with this side. We have a cargo station and we have a passenger station that is divided and there is a lot of tracks that are very very useful and the trains are moving uh, really good there is no uh, problem in the traffic of course so I have a lot of companies on this part because I'm supporting my city that's very near so everything here arrives by the train you can see that we have one train station here this is for the cargo it's supporting my industry on this side because I have a lot of warehousing and this is for the passengers so it's a pretty huge station it's a new look and this is for a reason because I have a new and uh, old station and this part we have warehouses and the companies so they are employing our people and you can probably see that there is not a lot of problem with traffic I done so much details on it and I can say that I used the mod move it a lot on this build to have everything uh, done neatly and perfectly so let's see this part here again this is the old station I need to show you this is for a reason because in the part 3 I want to show you my city uh, the expansion number 3 uh, this train station is old by style and that's why this part of the city will be old style city uh, I will show you that in the next episode but let's focus on the train station so we have two train stations for the passengers and I can probably say there is so many train tracks I, I kinda lost it here <laughs> and uh, I want to have it to be a big one to be very detailed so I can say that I hit the limit on my PC and one point I needed to delete some stuff to be able to record this video if you have some glitches it's on me sorry about that uh, again this is a very very detailed build uh, I can say that I'm very satisfied about it let's see the old station here it's looking very very nicely and very old style old style I really like it uh, let's see this part you can see that tracks are moving all over the place and we have a divided one is for the passengers on this one and on the right we have two divided trains for our industry for the cargo and uh, we have two ports that are supporting this part of the city uh, you can probably see that I have uh, something like a coal uh, that is all over the place because I have downloaded a couple of additions and this is the coal train station so I want to create something that we have similar I know this is the part of the ore industry but <laughs> it's black <laughs> so uh, again here we have the forest industry because I have a train station that is meant only for the forest only for the wood industry and I done a couple of details here I downloaded a couple of trucks with wood with empty to have it more detailed you can probably see uh, here is the train station for the forest industry you can download it uh, from the steam workshop if you want and I added a couple of cranes all over the place uh, this is all custom the the cargo everything here and uh, uh, here is a small container port not the biggest one very very small I didn't have a lot of space to create it and uh, it's connected by this road on here and it's connected uh, on this road on this side so we have two connections and we have a one tunnel connection from the both side so traffic is okay because we have a lot of trucks moving on this place 
and uh, let's see our uh, industrial warehouse industry of course I can say that this is looking good but I want to hear your opinion do you like it because the last video that I made uh, let's see here this is the airport that I built this is the last video and uh, the response was very very good so thank you about that I had a couple of good comments uh, subscriptions likes so thank you so much and uh, I'm going to continue this city build because I'm very satisfied and I have a good response from the people who are following this channel of course uh, let's go back to the train station it's huge and I can say that I overdone it with the train tracks <laughs> I can say that so if you like the city and uh, if you like the train station leave a like leave a subscription uh, if you have an opinion what can I do better here please leave a comment I will listen to you of course and if you like what I did here please uh, write something or subscribe to the channel uh, so I'm going to continue this city build there is going to be a couple of more episodes because uh, I'm having a problem with my PC I'm hitting the limits and uh, even though I have 24 gigabytes of RAM it's not enough for this game <laughs> it's not enough so I'm going to search for the limits and record a couple of more episodes this train station is connected on two sides let's see again from zoom out it's a pretty huge one uh, I wanted to create something that can be used by passengers by industry so I combined uh, two passenger sta stations and I think I have five or six industrial train stations that are using it for the cargo and uh, yeah when I go on this it's very very detailed so if you like the video if you like the train station like share and subscribe thank you so much for watching and see you on the next video